Hey guys, this is Coach Kelly with our workout for Saturday, April 25th. We have a long conditioning piece starting off with 80 kettlebell swings. So if you have a kettlebell, we're going full kettlebell swings, using those hips, driving all the way overhead, keeping that back in a nice strong position at the bottom. 80 of those, breaking them up into whatever sets you need. If you don't have a kettlebell, we can go dumbbell snatch. So that's going to be alternating arms. You're going to do 40 each, 80 total. So from the floor, you're going to use those hips again, all the way overhead, switch arms at the bottom, or on the way down, and through 80 of those. After that, we're doing 200 double unders. So with your jump rope, 200 double unders. If you're doing singles, you can do 300 singles. If you don't have a jump rope, you can find a line to jump over, do some type of cardio, maybe two-ish minutes on that. After that, you're going to repeat a half hour rep, so 40 kettlebell swings or dumbbell snatches, and then 100 double unders or 150 single unders. The catch with this workout is every two minutes, you're going to stop wherever you are and do 10 push-ups. So just make sure your core is nice and tight for those push-ups. We're not burning our weight down, keeping our elbows in close, all the way down, all the way up. Ten nice quality push-ups every two minutes. If you need to go down to your knees, no problem. All the way down, same thing, all the way up, keeping that core tight. After you finish that conditioning, we've got five sets of strength for you. You can find a bench or a chair or anywhere that you can get your back on and use some kind of lighter weight. So if you have a lighter dumbbell or even just like a 10 pound plate, we're going to do 8 to 12 pullovers. We said dumbbell pullovers if that's what you have. So you're going to keep your core down on the bench. Put that dumbbell plate above. I'm not letting my back arch. So nice tight core, bringing that dumbbell all the way back overhead, trying to get a nice range of motion and back up. 8 to 12 of those, finishing off your strength set with 30 seconds of hollow rocks. So ideally, keeping our arms and feet just off the ground, 